Hi everyone, in today's video I'm going to be doing an unboxing from Clearance XL. If you haven't heard of Clearance XL, it's an online store which sells food past its best before date, which is completely edible. Buying food this way can save your family a fortune. You are not going to believe how much I paid for these two boxes of food. So let's crack them open and see what I have. <laughs> I have my delivery slip now and I can tell you this entire order only cost £26.67 so that's incredible, the two boxes worth of stuff, amazing. So the first things I bought were six of these Old El Paso taco kits which are for fish which you can use chicken as well if you want, you don't have to put the fish inside, it's just a recommendation. Now these are £2.50 each in the supermarket, I only paid 50p for a case of six, so that's incredible. A lot of this order is going to be shared out with family and friends, so I got a lot of cereal. And the first one that I'm going to show you are the s'mores. Now I've got six of these, and they were 50p each, where they retail for around £2 in certain stores, so this is a bargain. This is pretty incredible if you suffer with a gluten intolerance. It's seven kilos of gluten-free cornflakes. Now they come inside a box and then the cornflakes are in a separate like, packet. They're not in separate cereal boxes. So the best thing to do with this is to separate them up in Tupperware containers. Now this was only $1.99 with a retail price of $22.99. So what an incredible saving. So if, if you know a few people with gluten intolerances, you could share this out. I mean, it's going to cost you pennies, so it's a fantastic buy. So next up, I have Kellogg's Muesli. Now, this was only a 59p a packet, and they retail between three and four pounds in the supermarket, so it's a great saving. Now, this was an incredible saving. So these are Heinz Hot Pepper, Lively and Fruity, a super spicy sauce for pizza or steak. These are only one p each. How amazing is that? A penny. So I got six of these. Because a lot of this stuff is heavy, Callum is coming in to help me. So, you want to share them then, and I'll tell you the price. Well, we have six Hellman's Chipotle Smoky Sauce. Which is also perfect for barbecues, and these, yet again, were only one p each. That's incredible. But these will also go with the taco kits. They will do. So, so yeah, yeah. Double use. So, yeah. put them behind us. I'm just stacking everything here. God, that is actually quite heavy with just them six. So Clarence XL don't just sell like food items, they also sell toiletries and in this they include plasters for some reason. These are Dora Explorer Band-Aids, so these are American brand, but if you go into the supermarket they're around £1.50 to £2 for character themed plasters. These were only 33p a packet, so I decided to get a couple because Molly is always like injuring herself. Well, hardly injuring, just scraping herself and she wants a plaster. So. Not even that sometimes, she just wants a plaster. She just wants a plaster, so a 33p, she can have some. There's 25 assorted sizes in each packet, so, and they're by Johnson Johnson, so it's a good brand, so 33p. Yeah, she can get nuts with these. <laughs> she will do, yeah. Okay. What's next? Some of you might remember these from Christmas. These are the fancy Ferrero Rochers. These were £10 to buy in the supermarket and they cost me only £3. So I'm going to be enjoying these. There's 24 in there. Like, where can you get 24 Ferrero Rochers for £3? Clearance XL, that's where. Clearance XL. So, <laughs> yeah. yeah. We're going to be taste testing these in a little while. So. We might have to repeatedly taste test those, unfortunately. Yeah, yeah. These um, were best before the 4th, 2017. So, I don't think there's going to be hardly any difference to the ones. Best before, that's fine. But, yeah, we're going to be looking forward to trying those in a little while. So, let's move on. So I did say I bought a lot of cereal in this order and I wasn't kidden. The next cereal I bought is Alpha Bites. Now these have 12 essential vitamins and minerals, no high fructose corn syrup and no artificial flavours. These were 33p each, so that is a great deal. So I bought six of these. Callum's just looking at the puzzles on the back. As you do. The next thing is the best chocolate in the world, Kinder Chocolate. The mini bars, you get four in a pack, they're 39p each. Which isn't the cheapest items, but I just like Kinder Chocolate. And there's it's a, so good. There's a massive saving compared to the store. Now Callum's like, I want to eat it, I want to eat it, I want to eat it, but I was going to do the taste test later. Don't melt the chocolate. Make me go down there. So we're going to do a little taste test of this now. 
I'll try a little bit of this, I don't eat a lot of chocolate over. Alright, still good. Mmm. Mmm. Still good. So Callum's made a new rule, he's actually going to be tasting, or we're going to be tasting as we're going. Yeah. Oh no, the box split! Oh no! <laughs> but basically, I've got ten of these. Um, they're KP salt and vinegar crisps, and these were ten for a pound. Well, I will say this, the pack is a little bit flat. But well, they yeah, could just sell them tight, actually. Oh, they are! Yeah. Some are a bit rushed, but they're still crispy. They're still good. Yeah, and they're nice. And I'm still hungry. Oh, We're turning this into a mop bang. Yeah! So, yes, I'm definitely going to taste test these. These are Little Jelly Men from Harry Bow, and these were 39p a packet. Gonna try them. I'm not really a sweetie man, I'm more of a chocolate kind of guy. Mm. So like I said previously, they do sell toiletry items. Now you'll recognise these Beverly Hill toothpastes from like Super Drug and Boots and they're around 4 99 each. These are only 39p. What? I know, isn't it amazing? And these are Total Breath Black, so it's for people with bad breath. It is black! Look at that! Yeah, it is. It's <laughs> one with activated charcoal, so it's a compact... Oh, smell that. It's really nice. Oh, it's sweet. Go in. Oh, I want to set a knife! Oh! Look, you go in for this Just one. Just set on a knife! <laughs> Put it down! Right. This is what you get. Subscribe to our channel. <laughs> anyway, so <laughs> the <ass>. next... <laughs> The next thing, well, items that I bought are these gluten-free bouillons. Now, this one is a reduced salt, and this is just the vegetable one. Now, these are around £2 in the supermarkets. I paid only 25p each, which is an incredible saving. It's really good. Can you remember when I was on these and it cost a fortune to yeah. buy them? Next items are McBitties Digestive. These are normally £1 a packet. They were only 39p. So, not the cheapest. Okay. Right, now, the thing is, with uh, biscuits, you can tell if they've gone off because they go really soft. Mm. Oh. That's not quite a few. Whoa, 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 whoa! Mmm. They're really good. They're really good. They're not gone soft at all. So, next up, I have these McBitty Digestives, and these mm. are vanilla cream ones. So, these were only 33p a packet. So, yet again, Callum's going to be trying them. And then I'll have a little bite. So even more cereal here, these are Cocoa Pebbles, which I guess are the American version of what they called Cocoa Pops. No, because no, not. Because they're, they they're, are. they're flakes, they're not pebbles. They're actually like flakes. Well, so they're like cornflakes, well, you know. They're like Frosties, but chocolate, I think. Yeah, so kind of like Cocoa Pops, but cornflakes. And it says it turns the milk to milkshake too, so these were only 50p each. Lastly, for the cereal, we have Golden Crisp, which is sugar puffs. But well, they're not called sugar puffs anymore. Well, we tried them. They're called honey puffs, aren't they? I'm going to try it. These were £50. Pound of 50, £50? Pounds? No, that would be expensive. No, these were 50 p a box. Oh, I love the smell. I love the smell. They do just smell like sugar puffs. Yeah. And it's also good to note that Food banks do taste food past its best before date, well a lot of food banks do because um, supermarkets tend to donate their stock so if you do get stuff and you actually don't like it you can actually just give it to your food bank. They're yeah, still cr crunchy, crispy. That's sugar that is... No, it's sugar bath. So we just had to turn the camera off because Callum decided to just flood the floor with sugar bath. I wanted a sugar bath shower. <laughs> Yeah, stop eating! Oh, come on! Alright, so the next thing is this Maggie So Juicy, and this is a rustic beef one pot. So it's basically for like stews and stuff, I guess. And this was only 19p, so that's a great saving compared to the supermarket. Because supermarkets are around like 79p, aren't they? And oh, sometimes, right, uh, sometimes they're on offer for, for yeah, 50p, yeah. but 19p <laughs> is really good. These are really good, but we're not sure what they're going to taste like. So we got four of these multi packs, and they're sausage and brown sauce walkers. So you get six in a packet. So four of these packets for only one pound. Thanks, Ted. Can I try one? Is it odd? 
Yeah. After eating chocolate, yes. <laughs> oh, it's spicy. Yeah, it just tastes like brown sauce and sausages. Yeah, actually not bad. Yeah. Next up, I got five of these Paul Hollywood. These are roll mixers, so basically burger rolls. You make them at home, and these were best before Feb 2017, but. They don't feel like they're stuck together or anything like some of the best before like bread mixers are. And these were only a pound, so it's really good. If you're having a barbecue, you can make your own rolls. And I bet you they taste a lot better fresh as well. You'll need olive oil and water. I actually look forward to trying those. Just going to pull them I'm out. I look forward to cooking them. These are, I don't know why I got them, but they were 10p each. I thought, let's do a variety of things. Now these are like, are these like prawn crackers? Yeah, they look like it. Yeah, I think so. Anyway, they are from Susie Wan. Woo! They're Italian, tell you that. They smell anything. Boy, all this stuff is going to be gone. There's a deodorant in here. I don't even know. I don't them. They taste fishy, don't they? I don't like them. That's probably good. Oh, they're shrimp crackers. So I've got this footy cheek roll on deodorant, which is not for your feet, it is actually for your pits. And these were 29p each, which is actually cheaper than the like ones what you can get, which are the value ones. I know. wonder what it smells like. It smells quite fresh actually. Well, if deodorant didn't smell fresh, why would you buy it? Yeah, sometimes they don't, sometimes they just have no odour. That's really nice, 59p. I thought originally it's for your feet. Smell? There you go. There you go. People are going to be in the comments and not too mean to it now. So we're pretty much at the end of the box. They're thrown in this little cone thing. I'm not sure Mine. what it is. Cone <laughs> bite? But put that down Belgium for now. Boys. But I did buy this bar roux. I think that's how you pronounce it. Marshmallow, raspberry and vanilla. Um, it's a marshmallow bar. Which is handcrafted in Belgium with natural ingredients. So I'm guessing this is one of like the fancy things which you'll find like near the gluten free aisle. So I'm gonna do it. Ooh, I don't know. So do a taste test. Mmm. <gasps> chocolate. Oh, what is that? Mmm. Chocolate. It's like a little cornetto, but you put chocolate. So if I duck, you can see all our clearance XL stuff. Actually, not all of it because the cornflakes are over there and all these old El Paso kits. Look how many of them. All right. I'm just dropping them all, but yeah, we've got six of these. 50p oh, for six smell that. taco kits. Oh, I smell that. That smells really oh. nice, actually. But all this from Clearance XL for £26. So if you haven't gone over to the website, I'll leave a link in the description below. Let me know if you order anything. And until next time, I'll see you soon. Bye. But if you know what we can do with seven kilos of cornflakes, please tell us. Eat them.